Have you ever received a message from a stranger on Instagram asking you to send them inappropriate photos or videos? Or maybe someone has threatened to share personal information or images if you don't comply with their demands. If so, you may have been a victim of sextortion. Sextortion is a form of sexual exploitation where someone uses coercion, threats, or blackmail to obtain sexual favors or explicit images or videos from another person. This can happen through various platforms including social media, email, or messaging apps. However, Instagram is a popular platform for sextortion due to its large user base and the ease of sending direct messages. In the United States, sextortion has become a growing problem in recent years. According to a report by the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, there was a 91% increase in reports of online enticement and sextortion from 2019 to 2020. In addition, a survey conducted by the Pew Research Center found that 51% of young people aged 18 to 29 have experienced some form of online harassment, including sexual harassment and sextortion. So what should you do if you become a victim of sextortion on Instagram? The first step is to report the content and account to Instagram directly. And here's how to do that. Open the Instagram app and go to the post or account that you want to report. Tap the three dots in the top right corner of the post or profile. Select report from the menu. Choose the reason why you're reporting the post or account. Follow the on-screen instructions to provide additional information such as screenshots or descriptions of the content. It's important to note that reporting content or accounts on Instagram does not always guarantee the removal of that content or account. Instagram has community guidelines that prohibit explicit content and sexual solicitation, but they may not always catch every violation. In addition, the process of reviewing reports can take time, so it's important to be patient. If you feel threatened or unsafe due to sextortion, it's also important to reach out for help. You can contact local law enforcement and file a report, but also don't hesitate to reach out to fast-acting agencies like Digital Forensics Corporation who can intercept the situation and resolve it before it becomes a larger problem. They can also provide you with resources and support to address the situation immediately. In addition to reporting and seeking help, there are also steps you can take to prevent sextortion from happening in the first place. Be cautious about who you interact with online. Don't accept friend requests or direct messages from strangers. Avoid sharing personal information such as your full name, address, or phone number with people that you don't know. Be mindful of the content that you share on social media. Think twice before sharing explicit photos or videos, even if it's with someone you trust. Set your account to private to limit who can see your post and direct messages. By taking these precautions, you can reduce your risk of becoming a victim of sextortion on Instagram or any other platform. In conclusion, sextortion is a serious issue that can have long-lasting effects on its victims. If you become a victim of sextortion on Instagram, it's important to report the content or account and seek help from law enforcement or agencies like DFC. Additionally, taking steps to prevent sextortion can reduce your risk of being targeted in the first place. Until next time, thanks for watching and stay safe out there.